Okay, now I am doing another video uh, that I think I missed one difficult part of one test route. I will cover it now. Okay, I'm just at the test center as you can see. It. Um, that will be down into um, Sasvi Road roundabout, third exit. Go on the dual carriageway a little bit, first exit out. And then there's a little uphill and there's a little small roundabout which is the, the Toha Road roundabout. Okay, I cover that one now because I don't think I ever covered it and I, it's, it's actually always busy, you know, maybe not today, but it may, most of the time it's busy. Okay, so um, let's get on with it, okay. All right, so I will check my one, two, three, four, five. I signal, okay, up my clutch and I looked around again, go slow, nicely, okay. As you see, very narrow here. Okay, so I'm just gonna give a little angle for myself and drive in. As a stop line, no matter what, you need to stop. You stop, make the cast, stop, first gear, and now you can move forward and keep looking right, left, right, okay? And opa, signal, so we're gonna turn, look back again, and I will take here, the left turn yes yeah? so center left mirror here you go it's bunching up a little bit but it's okay I'm ready to go okay that actually should be a roundabout this is a busy busy turn and it's very difficult for pupils when they're going out you know I think that should anybody who's listening this should change this for the roundabout okay and the next one too but that's just my opinion okay all right so Again, I will not focus who is coming and I focus where do I stop. It's still not enough for me to go through, okay? Um, so I'm not gonna risk it. Okay, he's moved. So I'm gonna look in my left window, there's no bicycle there. So let's just stop at the line. I looked again back, there you go. First gear, I keep signaling, I think, no, no, yeah, not yet. Maybe after the red car is coming. Yes, exactly. So here we go. There we go. Now I'm gonna go again for the Sasfield Road roundabout. Okay. Um, I will. I stayed a bit on my right a little bit. To be frankly honest, I think there was too much on my right. But okay. So when I approach the roundabout, I will signal right make sure everybody knows I go over 12 o'clock yes so right here I'm gonna start to signal right lowering my speed back in second gear up my clutch keep rolling with it okay and nice and gently I will stop just that distance good back to first gear and I stop now okay all right just a little movement so I just follow them there you go and I stop again Okay, and the handbrake on, and I wait for my green light. Okay, so now I'm gonna stay as right as possible. Yeah, and I'm gonna drive into the lane which is gonna show me right arrow. Okay, so here we go. I'm keep signaling, I'm not touching unnecessarily the uh, road markings, and I see the light is red. I keep signaling, yeah, and I just keep positioning my car. Okay. Now, when I'm going out from this um, uh, this roundabout, I'm gonna join to the dual carriageway, okay? You need to pick the speed, and that's when he will see you can or not, because the speed limit will change. Okay, now I'm gonna change my signal to my left, center, left middle. Sorry guys, I just wanna look around properly. Look. Just on the edge, okay? So here, the speed limit is changing. So if you don't pick up speed, it's gonna give you a point for not progress enough in a um, on a straight, yeah. So I need to pick up speed now. I go about it's 100 now already, so I go 70, 80, center right. Okay, so I signal right. Just look on my blind spot as you can see it already. Here we go, and I'm picking up the speed because I want to join in, and also I want to uh, pick, pick up the speed because the speed limit is 
100. Okay, I'm going 90 now. So I see this guy's quite slow. So I can't go faster. The three white line in the green uh, zone. So I got a signal left because I'm leaving it now. You can see he is very busy. Yeah. Now you need to break early a little bit here. Okay. And keep your signal on until you leave the dual carriageway, which is right about right here. You see the line is there. So I'm not on the dual carriageway anymore. Break. There you go. Third gear, second gear. And now he here you need your clutch you need to be able to roll with clutch okay all right so a lot of people get points probably here because they might losing you know the the crank down of the car or uh, some reason they're losing the engine okay so i just gonna go nice yeah my clutch is not fully up otherwise i can't control the car so just keep rolling nicely the mic my clutch is on a biting point now okay so even if i put a camera you wouldn't you wouldn't be able to see it but it just balancing out the speed you see my speed it's nine kilometer per hour nine okay all right now why is this so i'm not saying difficult but it's not easy because a lot of car comes in you knew you under pressure you stressed and your clutch and this is a difficult one but here you need calmness this is when you when you're gonna learn how to uh, do the clutch okay um, I'm not lifting my clutch fully yes because I don't want a car to speed up too much I need to keep the distance in front of the car okay so I'm just keeping nice and a few meter okay and in the meantime I'm checking maybe someone just shows up yeah okay now you see the roundabout there i'm gonna take the turn across because that's the exit what on the test route is most of the time okay so you're gonna take the third exit so this one is a very busy roundabout you need to watch out okay because it's it is just busy okay and you can see already because we're bunching up here so it's definitely busy okay i just see what's the camera see okay all right okay and it's 50 from here so you could go faster but it's irrelevant because it's just busy okay so I'm just change my air conditioner a little bit here we go okay so when i'm gonna join to that road there is no stop line or stop sign so you don't need a handbrake unless you feel you're rolling back okay but you don't need the handbrake okay all right only when you see the stop sign or stop line or you feel you're rolling back or you're uncomfortable okay all right good so we're gonna speed is six seven kilometer per hour you need to go nice and just okay so a lot of people he goes a little bit fast so you because the turn is quite sharp so you if you beat faster but obviously when the road is empty you might get too wide okay if you don't break early enough okay Okay, good. Now, and you just have to see what the other people are doing, you know. I usually look before the, you know, I can see through the, the fence, so I can see, yeah, okay. And maybe someone will let me in, and I will take the third exit, okay. So I'm not signaling yet. You see here, here we go, and I'm keep looking. Here we go, okay. So he lets him in, good. Okay, now he will let me in, thank you very much. Now I'm gonna signal right center, right middle, because I take the third exit, yeah? So now I keep signaling. So he, okay, I was a bit too. Okay, he's going out and he's going straight, so I could just get in. Second gear, keep looking now, change my signal, center, left mirror, and that's it. And now this road could be very tricky as well, okay? I look in my right mirror because it's no space. So I go so slow, no space, no speed, don't forget that, okay? Now, and we can speed up. And the next one is a difficult one because the turn will be up and it shows up very, very, very quickly. Okay, so center, right? See, if I don't pass the middle lane, I don't signal, I keep a meter, perfect. Now again, I just slow down, let this uh, Land Rover pass right mirror again and I have a lot of space to go in. It was just okay in third gear. Now the next turn is very sharp, so if you don't break on time, goodbye. 
you're gonna go someone else's lane i mean the other lane and goodbye so you see the sign there center left boom now i'm gonna just go back to third i break see how sharp is it it's crazy up my clutch and just turn enough and there you go okay now i'm gonna look on that mirror again my right mirror because i will pass the car so okay good there you go i'm gonna touch the green line so there you go and that's it technically you know like it, it could be busy and could be surprising particularly this roundabout it could be so busy and um, and it can surprise you you really need to watch out what the people are doing okay because you could get the wrong idea okay and i think she goes the left mirror second gear and i will just park on my left after the Thanks for watching. See you on my lesson.